Hello everybody, this is a trailer for my new video, How to Finish a Painting. In this video, I'll be talking about start how to start their painting, how to explore alternatives, timing yourself, and in being productive with that time. I hope you enjoy. So, so far it's about 8 minutes, 55 seconds, and this is as far as I'm going to go with this. I see a lot of good details um, already. I can see... So, for example, I can see I got little details here and there. So, for some fun, I got some clear weapon reads, like thinking of what he could be. And it's like the stuff that I talked about in the previous video, uh, where you know you should do some brainstorming ahead of time. And for me, I, I did a little bit in my own head. I didn't write it down or draw it, but I just thought about it for a little bit. I was like, one guy with a mechanical arm. And that's pretty much it. You know? Sometimes that's the kind of feedback you get from your client. I want a guy with a mechanical arm. And I think it's important to start to understand what it is about your own style and your own technique that slows you down or speeds you up, you know? And for me, when I started time myself, I was doing it because I was trying to do it before work started or before, um, you know, I had to go home or before a meeting. And then I started just really paying attention to the th things that I started wasting my time better habits that will help you finish paintings and help you get further along with your paintings versus sitting around and just, you know, doodling. Doodling is fun, but it definitely takes a lot of time. But there was some lack of clarity going on in this neck area, and I think that had to do with me adjusting his his head proportions. But remember how I said if you can have all that information from the beginning, you, you save yourself time. And I'll start putting all the little detail in here. And I already can tell there's some proportion problems. So there's a few ways to do this. I'm going to try to liquefy.